Donald J. Trump. Welcome. An all-female town hall could have been a risky move for Donald Trump, who's been trailing with women in recent national polls. But he was met with a particularly warm crowd in Battleground, Georgia, for an event hosted by Fox News. Trump made a number of false claims throughout the hour-long interview on the subjects of abortion, immigration, inflation and national security, but one went particularly viral. I want to talk about IVF. I'm the father, you don't I'm hear the father that every day. of IVF. I'm the father of IVF, so I want to hear this question. In vitro fertilization is a fertility treatment that has come under threat since the Supreme Court's decision to overturn Roe v. Wade. It's unclear what he meant by the comment, but he insisted the Republican Party was entirely in favor. It drew reactions from across the country, including from his rival Kamala Harris. I found it to be quite bizarre, actually. He called himself the father of IVF. And if what he meant is taking responsibility, well, then, yeah, he should take responsibility for the fact that one in three women in America lives in a Trump abortion ban state. Wednesday was also Harris's debut on Fox News, sitting down with anchor Brett Beyer for her first ever interview on the traditionally Republican-leaning network. Let me be very clear. My presidency will not be a continuation of Joe Biden's presidency. And like every new president that comes in to office, I will bring my life experiences, my professional experiences, and fresh and new ideas. I represent a new generation of leadership. In the afternoon, she was joined by more than 100 Republicans who are backing her candidacy at a campaign event in Battleground, Pennsylvania, focusing on patriotism and unity.